Yeah, hello guys. Yeah, in this tutorial, I'm going to guide you on how to do the first um, GitHub task. Let's go over it together. Okay, so if you don't have a GitHub account, create first of all, create a GitHub account. Okay, so uh, create a personal access token on GitHub. We'll do that later. Uh, update your profile on the internet okay if we've not done that ensure to do that uh, what else again create your first repository using the graphical interface on github.com so let's do that now <coughs> so go to github.com okay I'm going to change this to desktop view then I'll click on this new green button here to click create uh, the first uh, repository so what's the name we are asked to give it this name okay and the description should be this Should be a public repo and there should be no readme dot github ignore and license file attached to it okay so you leave readme dot readme file leave it blank and click on create repository okay so we've done that so now the next step is um So we have to uh, assess our repository. Now for you to assess your repository, what you do is um, you copy this code here, git clone, copy it up to this side. That's what you're going to use to assess your repository. You understand? Uh -huh. But you have to replace this section of the code. This section of the code. You have to replace this section of the code with your personal token that we are going to create in a moment and you have to replace this section of the code with your github username that's all okay so right now i'm going to create my personal token <coughs> uh, let me change this back to okay let me just use a different github account let me go github.com okay so I'll go over to setting scroll down then go over to developers option click uh, click on um, what's it called personal access token okay so I already have a personal access token here uh, this one here uh lehal i can use it i can decide to use that okay so for you to create yours what you do is you click on this uh, button this um generate new token you click on it give the token a name give it a name then when you're done you change this to no expiration okay change it to no expiration then highlight all this checkbox everything when you're done with it you come over here and click on generate uh, token so when you're done with that you're going to get your token so copy the token come over to this side <coughs> get your token ready but firstly let's go over to Thomas and try to assess our our virtual box so ssh copy your ssh paste it there okay go back for the password Oh. 
Okay, so where are we now? PWD. Okay, we are the root directory. Okay, so now we need to clone our repository. So you copy your. One minute. So what you do now is the access key you've gotten, get the access key, put it here and add your username then copy this code from here to here then paste it here to clone the repository we just create created i'm going to do that and then we'll continue okay so i've just cloned my repository if you've done that you're supposed to receive a message that says uh, you've successfully cloned an empty um, repository let's check for it uh, we do LX okay that's it over there okay so we can go inside by typing CD that okay you clear the screen okay so the next item says we should create a file readme.md with this content okay so do an echo do an lx to check for the file okay you can do an lxx to check for the content of the file okay okay so now was the next item um, okay we are asked to update our uh, our git um, identity so to do that we use this configuration this one over here this one over here So that's what we are going to do now. So we say git config. Git config dash dash global. Then we'll do user dot name. give it a name then we'll do another get get config dash dash global user dot email that go is 2010 at gmail.com am i correct that go is 2010 at gmail.com okay okay so what's the next item um okay so we asked to commit our
We are asked to commit this file with the following commit message, my first commit. So I'll come over here and type um, git status. Okay, so we're going to do git hard. Then a dot. Then we'll do git status again. clear the screen <clears throat> so we'll say oh sorry we we'll say git commit why is this thing that slow today minus m L specify the message okay we've done that okay are we supposed to push it let me check uh my first commit this 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 okay we're not asked to push it right okay so let me just um validate okay so we are supposed to push it okay so get push Okay, so we are done with that.